Former Virginia Governor Bob McDonnell, once a rising star in the Republican Party, is on trial in Richmond facing federal corruption charges. His wife is also charged. McDonnell insists he's innocent of taking tens of thousands of dollars in gifts and loans in exchange for favors. He spent the past three days testifying. We'll be back on the stand Monday. Chip Reed has more. Leaving the courthouse, Bob McDonnell said he is to blame for his legal troubles, not his wife, Maureen. Uh, I'm the governor. I'm, I'm responsible. Mm -hmm. But on the stand, he said it was his wife who initiated talks with businessman Johnny Williams about getting a $50,000 loan. He says she also arranged for expensive vacations paid for by Williams, including one to Cape Cod. The McDonald's are charged with accepting over $165,000 in gifts from Williams. In return, they allegedly used their influence to promote his health supplement company. McDonald admitted he eventually consented to the $50,000 loan and even asked Williams for $20,000 more. But he suggested that was proper because, quote, I considered him to be a friend at that point. Any assistance he gave Williams, McDonald said, was not because of the gifts. As governor, he wanted Williams, a Virginia businessman, to succeed. It means jobs, McDonald said. Williams, he insisted, asked for almost nothing in return for the gifts. The only thing he'd asked me that year was to call his father on his birthday. Wrapping up his testimony for the week, McDonnell said, I misjudged Johnny Williams. I had no idea that he would come into federal court and make false statements against me to save himself. Next week will be even tougher for McDonnell. He'll be cross-examined by the prosecution. For CBS This Morning Saturday, Chip Reed, Washington.